Causes and Remedies of Knocking Noise on Idle After Gearbox Change When you change a gearbox and initially experience smooth performance followed by rough gear changes and a knocking sensation during idling, several factors could be contributing to the problem. These issues can range from mechanical problems related to the gearbox installation itself, transmission fluid levels, or even potential engine and sensor misalignments. Here's a detailed breakdown of the possible problems and their remedies. 1. Transmission fluid level or quality. One of the most common causes of rough gear changes and knocking during idling after a gearbox replacement is an issue with the transmission fluid. Even though the gearbox was changed, if the transmission fluid is low, contaminated, or of the wrong type, it can lead to poor gear engagement. Low fluid levels can cause inadequate lubrication and cooling of the internal components, leading to increased friction, rough shifts, and even knocking sounds at idle. If the transmission fluid is not at the correct level, or if it was not replaced during the gearbox swap, it may have become contaminated with debris from the old transmission or oxidized over time, causing the problems you're experiencing. Remedy Check the transmission fluid level and ensure that it is topped up to the manufacturer's specifications. If the fluid appears dirty or has a burnt smell, a transmission fluid flush and replacement may be necessary. Be sure to use the correct type of fluid as specified by the vehicle manufacturer, as using the wrong fluid can exacerbate transmission issues. 2. Gearbox mount or misalignment. Another potential issue is the gearbox mount or the alignment of the gearbox during installation. A gearbox mount is designed to hold the transmission securely in place and absorb vibrations. If the mount is damaged, worn out, or improperly installed, it can lead to excessive movement of the gearbox, resulting in rough gear changes and knocking sounds. Misalignment of the gearbox can also lead to similar issues, as improper alignment places additional stress on the transmission components, causing uneven engagement of the gears and creating rough shifts. Remedy Inspect the gearbox mount for signs of wear or damage. If it is found to be faulty, it should be replaced. Additionally, ensure that the gearbox is properly aligned and mounted according to the manufacturer's specifications. A professional mechanic should be able to check the alignment and reposition the gearbox if necessary. 3. Faulty Clutch or Torque Converter If your vehicle uses a manual transmission, the clutch could be the source of the problem. A worn or improperly adjusted clutch can cause rough gear changes, as the clutch is not disengaging or engaging smoothly with the flywheel. On the other hand, if your vehicle is automatic, the torque converter may be the culprit. The torque converter is responsible for transferring engine power to the transmission, and if it is malfunctioning, it can lead to delayed or rough gear shifts, as well as knocking sounds during idling when the transmission is in gear but the vehicle is stationary. Remedy For manual transmissions, inspect the clutch for wear or misalignment and adjust or replace it if necessary. If the vehicle has an automatic transmission, the torque converter should be checked for faults or signs of wear. A professional mechanic can perform these checks and, if necessary, repair or replace the faulty component. 4. Gearbox Internal Issues Although the gearbox was replaced recently, internal issues could still arise if the gearbox wasn't installed correctly or if there was an existing problem with the replacement part. Rough gear changes can occur if the synchronizers, gears, or bearings inside the gearbox are worn or damaged. Additionally, a knocking noise during idle could indicate that internal components of the gearbox are not meshing correctly, leading to abnormal noise and shifting problems. This could be the result of poor quality parts used during the installation or a manufacturing defect in the new gearbox. Remedy If internal gearbox problems are suspected, it may be necessary to remove and inspect the gearbox for wear, damage, or defective components. This is a more intensive repair, and in some cases, a replacement gearbox may be required if internal damage is severe. Working with a qualified mechanic who specializes in transmissions is essential in this situation to accurately diagnose and resolve internal gearbox problems. 5. Electronic Control and Sensors Modern vehicles use electronic control units ECUs, and various sensors to manage transmission functions and ensure smooth gear changes. Even if no check engine light is present, it is still possible that a sensor related to the transmission or engine, such as the throttle position sensor TPS, or vehicle speed sensor VSS, is malfunctioning. These sensors provide critical information to the ECU about vehicle speed, engine load, and throttle position, which the ECU uses to control the timing and smoothness of gear changes. 
If any of these sensors are sending incorrect or erratic signals, it can lead to rough gear shifts and knocking noises during idling, even though the engine light is inactivated. Remedy A qualified mechanic should run a diagnostic scan on the vehicle's ECU to check for any fault codes related to the transmission or engine sensors. Even if no warning lights are illuminated, intermittent or soft faults can still be present. Once the faulty sensor is identified, it can be replaced or recalibrated to restore proper transmission performance. Your vehicle's rough gear changes and knocking during idling could be caused by several factors, including transmission fluid issues, gearbox misalignment, faulty mounts, clutch or torque converter problems, internal gearbox damage, or sensor malfunctions. The best course of action is to systematically diagnose each of these potential problems. Start with the easiest fixes, such as checking the fluid levels and quality, then proceed to more complex issues like inspecting the gearbox mount, alignment, and internal components. Working with a qualified mechanic who can properly diagnose the issue is essential, especially since transmission problems can lead to more significant damage if not addressed promptly.